It's been a really long time since I last had a look. But is the guy on the roller coaster still going round? Hey guys, you're just one and only. My name is AJ. Welcome back to the episode of Let's Build a City. Episode, what is it, 304 or something like that. Is he going round? <gasps> has he actually stopped? He hasn't, has he? He was going for like, well, uh, he's been going non-stop. No, he is! <laughs> I was going to say, he has gone non-stop since we built this, and I have never touched it. This is literally, no joke, the best roller coaster, uh, definitely, I've ever built in Minecraft, but I think the best roller coaster in existence of Minecraft, because this has survived me logging on and logging off. Uh, world edits, it's, it's crashes, like the amount of times that this world has crashed for, you know, playing around with mods and trying to do like st stuff that you shouldn't really be trying to do. Uh, I've loaded this world up on servers, I've loaded it, I've copied and pasted it, I've moved the files, and every time I load it up, this little guy has always survived. I have never once re-pushed him or sent him back on his way, he just is always going. It's amazing. He's, he's literally like the little mascot of our city. What's his name? Iskal or something, isn't it? Itagure. It's just like a, a name that it made up when I first created him. And I only had him as like a little test to go around, but we just decided to leave him. And uh, and he hasn't stopped since. That is, that is brilliant. That is brilliant. The fishy dip. <laughs> the best roller coaster in Minecraft. That is amazing. Okay, anyway, uh, this is probably a really underrated part of the map, like I always forget about. And today, we're going to finish the pier. We're going to finish these stupid little things that I've wanted to do f since we first thought of the pier. Before we even started building it, I wanted these things. And for some reason, I've just never got around to doing it. We're going to do it today. Uh, but it's been so long since I've come here. I never seem to come here on world tours either. And it looks so cool. So you've got like slushy machines here, cola machines um everything on this side you can see on the sides what you want to get like you can get some um uh, i think this is a little sushi bar in fact isn't it like you you get like sushi you can get like little burgers going on look on this side you've got like burger bars and stuff so you get some fries uh some fish over there it, it's like really cool and then you've got little seating area this area i don't know really what i'm doing with it okay why does this not have windows in when this side does Oh, hey, huh? white windows on the left, black windows on the right. Man, I do so many things and then forget that I've done them. Like, it's meant to be one or the other. It must be, right? Let's turn that off. Um, And I've got none on this side. I think I prefer the white. So, <laughs> we, shall, uh, we shall change this up to white and be good. Um, But yeah, this is originally... I don't exactly know what they what they call it, so for argument's sake today, we're just going to call it like an auditorium. Um, it, it reminded me a lot of like a pier near me, uh, uh, like Great Yarmouth or or Brighton even, uh, and you get like uh, a big room and like you get comedy acts and or theatre acts and stuff in there. That was the original sort of idea behind this. The only trouble that we've got is that this isn't a very big area. Uh, it's actually a lot smaller <laughs> than we first uh, envisioned it to be. So I don't really know what we're going to use this interior space for. So we're not going to finish this part of today. I need you guys to say what you think it should be. What do we use it for? Obviously, it's, an, it's a lovely indoor space. We could have it as a restaurant. Like a restaurant would work quite well. Oh, I missed a window here. A restaurant would work very well in here. Like some nice seating around the edges here. Uh, we could have like the kitchens at the back and stuff. Like a, an open kitchen style one. You know how like Gordon Ramsay's TV show. Like the people sitting down can actually see into the kitchen. And they can see everything that's going on. That would be quite cool to do. So you could see the chefs cooking and stuff. And then they bring it out to you. Oh I sort of like that idea. We uh, we'll have a, a a more in depth think about it. I'm sure there's a wrong window here somewhere. No, okay. Uh, and then you could you you can it's not could you can go up the back here, and onto this top floor. 
which for some reason again has no windows <laughs> what's going on i think i must have said what do you guys prefer black or white and then i forgot what you guys said um which is why i had both black and white windows down down below it must have been right i can only assume yeah i really quite like that open restaurant feel Mhm. Mm like it's like probably one of the hardest places in the city to get a table at so uh, if you get a table here it's, it's like a really big thing it's like the the really impressive restaurant to try and impress your girlfriend out or something okay that's cool up here i don't know what it's going to do up here i need to have a ceiling on here as well because that looks really ugly and open but yeah and then we've got the uh the ferris wheel really cool little build used uh a lot of the aesthetic colored beacons here uh to make it look really pretty but yeah you go down here you can get in it yeah see now they usually have like wheels like at, at theme parks like car wheels to drive them but i think because it's so big it probably repair itself but yeah i'm mostly worried uh, or mostly want to do the main stretch down here today so i think the way that it's going to be easiest would be to copy an entire sort of lot or, or maybe we should actually like build one up so we need a, a block i don't think i want to use wool or anything i think i want to have it the same on all of them so like we could use oops cyan to go around there like that and maybe even the back yeah i think that's quite cool and then you can put what you want on here if we put anything on them i don't know if we'll put anything on them i always find it hard to fill these kind of stalls in minecraft but if we go copy and let me just put down some clay down on these ones on that blue one it's only two that we've got uh and then it looks like i'm doing it between every other one and i'm doing it sort of the the fourth block in so you got one two three and then one here so we want to sort of get it in line hit paste and then we miss one again and then we do one here fourth block in yeah cool good and then we want to flip it um i uh, east i'm gonna guess east i usually look first but I, I i haven't this time and that's the fourth block here i think it's the right distance out no nope, i think that one's gonna be one block behind it no nope, they're touching it okay no worries i had it right the first time no problem there we go paste and three four paste oh no 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 wrong one messing up a lot it's meant to be on this one paste no, that's an undo. Redo. And paste. And two more. So we'll have eight in total. That's quite a good number, I think. So we can get like all of the wool on top different. If you go too crazy with wool colours, they you sort of end up using the same one twice and it doesn't really work. That's not the right one. It's meant to be this one. One, two, three, and then that one. Now, you could go in that one and that one as well, but I think it would be a little bit tight, would it? A is quite a lot of blocks to try and get different on as well. Let's just have a look. Paste. Now, you know what? It does look quite cool going all the way up there. Uh, let's flip it back west. Paste that there. Oops. Nope. Undo. It's meant to be up this side. Okay. So we've got the eight down. Now let's choose our eight wool blocks now. So we've got orange is number one. We've got blue, which is number two. Uh, red. Yellow. 
See, this is what I mean. Because I've changed magenta, lime, pink, and purple, it's actually quite hard. Like, I think we're going to have to go with dark green. Um, You know, we could go with black. I've got black, but it's just birch. Black and white won't look too bad. One, two, three, four, five, six. I need two more. I'm going to have to scroll through. I think if I click on blocks here, it might be easier. Uh, I could go with a cyan one. I mean, that's sort of different enough. And we could go with a, a grey as like our, our last option, grey or brown. But I mean, the whole pier is brown. So you don't really want two of them. I think we're going to have to go with a grey. I think we're going to have to. So we've got our eight blocks there. So let's go that one to that one. And once we've got it set up, orange is 35-1. And we'll change it to, see the black one here, 5-2. Replace 35-1 with 5-2. So that's the black one. And then if we go down to here, we'll do this one. Uh, green. Which is 35-5. No, it wasn't, was it? No, it wasn't. 35-13. How did I get that wrong? 3513. And then this one will be, I don't know, red. 35.14. And then this one is going to be the cyan, which is 35.9. We'll have this one as yellow. 35.4. I think I'm running out of colours, aren't I? Grey <laughs> is 35.8. Oops, I hit something wrong. 35.8. What colour don't I have? Orange. I got. Let's do it in order. Black, orange, blue. Oh, it's 10. It's 10. It's not 8. It's 10. I need two more. Oh, no. Um, maybe I could do a, the same as what we had sort of there. So I can do like a red one and if I done cyan there and if I done yellow there, I'm going to have to sort of duplicate two of the colors, aren't I? So we'll have yellow here four, and then this one will be cyan. which is nine we then change yellow and cyan or we will change cyan maybe we just change it back to orange even orange would work see original color 35 one um we just need to swap them 35 nine with 35 one and then yellow can be black Which is four with five two. So we've got two orange ones and two black ones. Uh, it sort of sucks that I've got black orange and then black orange. Maybe I change that to red. And that's cyan. I think that's what I'm going to do. This one becomes cyan. I don't want two black and white ones. Uh, so we want red with cyan. 14 with 9. 14 with 9. And then black one changes to red. I'll replace 5, 2 with... I can't remember the number. 35, 9? Nope. What was the movie? 35, 14. Undo. I guess that a number then. Okay. That's cool. So we've got the stools going all the way down the side. But then in the middle, between the trees, I also want um, low, like, table stools, really. Um, so we're going to get... Oh, again, I want it to still stand out, though. So we're going to have to keep with the wool. And we're just going to have to do a, a, a colour that we don't have within these four. So, like, yellow, we don't have within these four. So I think I want to have... Oh, we could use clay, I suppose. No, I'll tell you what. I 
tell you what. We're going to get that. And I'm going to do like a, a, a sort of longer square one on these ones. We'll design one out. Like that. We'll put a little doorway on either side. We'll then get... I th do I want it like this? And then... Whoa. And then it goes up like that. I think that would look actually quite cool. So we said yellow wasn't in between these four. So we'll flip between white and yellow. I don't know which color it's going to end up on. Make your guesses. It's going to end up on yellow. See like that. I really like that. So you could have like another two stalls in there. And you'd have like two people showing the same one. And I think I want this between every other. So you'll end up with like a five. And then a five. Oh no, it'll be on that one then, wouldn't it? So if you have... Oh no, 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 that'll still work. That'll still work. Uh, are these the same distances between them? Man, that feels like it's a lot bigger. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Did I just not bother count? It sounds like something that I do is not bother counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh no, it's, it's right. It's good. Um, <laughs> but that comes out further than that side. Oh, poop. That's better. It's now in. It's now in line. Ah, what a giant mess up. Right, white, yellow, 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 yellow. That's good. That's good. That's better, right? So we shall again go here. One, two, three, four, and then on this one. And we'll put these around here. One, two, three, four. Okay, so what colour isn't anywhere near these ones? Um, cyan isn't anywhere near it. But we've already got two cyans. We've already got two oranges. Um, we've already done a yellow. I think I could probably get away with this one being black, I think. So we'll have the white. Black. White, black, white. The black and white. Actually, I've, I've, I've always stay away from the black ones. Like in when we done the medieval city, uh, just a little while back, we had a marketplace on there. I never done a black one because I didn't think it would look good. I actually really like it. Uh, and then up here, I think we'll do red. Oops. So I have a red one here, just because red's a nice strong color. Beautiful. Why does this... Why does that one start with red and end with red? And that one start with black and end with white. And that one start with white and end with yellow. So it should... That's one block too short. Which means something isn't spaced right. Like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Like that and that should be... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, that's wrong as well. That's seven. One, two, three, four four five six seven eight that we know that's eight one two three four five six seven eight so the last two aren't spaced correctly so i need to move oh man this is going to be a tricky little one to do we need to get all the leaves we'll just pull the that's going to screw so much up Okay, I'm going to go up here. I'm going to go right in between here. Pause two. And then I'm going to cut. Paste. Which gives us the extra block of room in the red tent that we needed. Which is good. So we just correct this one up. Uh, 
white, red, white. It shouldn't have broken any of the leaves and I think everything is still in line. It is. So then I just need to move this one tree over by one, which is really annoying because of course the leaves intersect on this one. Um, again, I think I'm going to have to black magic it. We'll go that one. And I'll just have to do a small correction at the end. In fact, if I just take this one, that'll be the easiest way. Cut. Paste. That's two blocks. Undo. Paste. That's good. So if if we're right, we should have oops, making a mess. Eight blocks between these two trees as well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. And then those two get moved over there, and that's the least destructive way we could have done it. Good, 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 good. All right, so we've got those on the middle. Now, in the spots that don't have, uh, like, a tent, I think I want a nice seating area. But so we can see it on the overview map, I'm not going to use these type of chairs, and I'm not going to use those types of couches, because on, on the overview version they don't see them, and the pier is quite a, a part that I always look at when I, I see it. So we're going to use good old stairs. We're going to make them nice stand out with some white, and maybe we do... Do science on the edge, go a bit old school on there, or we've got the room we could make larger ones, so we could like fold them round on the side, like that. Oh, I do like that. So we have that and that. Well, I don't like that. I like them. I like them on their own. I don't know if I'm a fan of the white though. Maybe we do go with. Uh, we we do stick with wood. And we just go with. Oaks the floor. No spruce is the floor. Okay, so we can go with oak then. Let's go with oak. Let's see which one we prefer. I mean, a wooden bench does make more sense. It's not blending in that much with the. Yeah, no, I think oak. I think the quartz is a little bit too bright, a little bit too modern for like an old, old-timey pier like this. Yeah, that's better. So we'll stick down a load of these. I think I could probably speed this up. Click, click, copy. Over here. Maybe we put them on on the edges as well. Like over there, that could work as well. And paste. So we could have them like down. Oops. Like that. And like that. That does look quite cool. It's, it's quite cool that the middle of the couches line up. Oops. Where to clear? line up with each pole like perfectly look see this one lines up with that one perfectly that's really quite cool you want a lot of seating down here it's going to be a very busy area that one and that one i like this little bench design as well it's nice and chunky feeling and we'll put one more here look at the bottom Oh, I can't. I can do more on this side because I don't have the... Um... Oh, you know what? I'm still going to stick with one. There. Uh, that one. I'm actually really interested to back up from a distance now and look at this as well. Oh, that's not where it goes. Like, actually in Minecraft and just have a look. Like, if we go, I don't know, out to, out to sea a little bit and look in at it. Okay, that's the wrong one. How far up do we want to go? Probably not too much further than this, to be fair. I can't place blocks today. <laughs> I don't know if my hands are cold or something. I, I can't do it. I'll place one more here, look. One like that. And same on the other side. Well, that's pretty perfect, just as under there. Um, 
and then we do oh, oh yeah we've got the um uh the old binoculars that look out to see yeah that you put like a, a, a penny in or whatever and they they look out yeah okay so let's just have a fly let's, let's turn the old shadies on get these chunks loaded up it'll load in eventually I want to just I want to have a real colorful feeling going on. That's what you want. Just get it to load in. Yeah, that's really cool. Like all of those colors there now. I like the trees in the middle. It keeps that sort of uh, greeny feeling. You always got to have greens going through uh, oops, through wooden builds especially. You got to always have, have make sure you've got leaves going on. But that's really cool. I really like that. A bit plain, a bit blank at the start of the pier. Maybe we'll have a think on how we solve that. But again, it's going to be a very busy pedestrian area because it's also access to the beach. So you don't want too much stuff to, to crowd it up. I think I like this. I think I really like this, in fact. I'm going to leave it there. If you guys enjoyed the episode, hit that like button. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. And we should see you in the next episode don't forget to let me know what you want this to be i like the idea of a restaurant but if you guys have any other ideas then let me know and we'll come back here at another point and finish it off bye